Hi. Today, I basically tried all day to recover data from my failed SSD, which did not work. I mean, I tried everything. I used so many tools. For instance, the Hirons boot, all of them, all of the uh, tools that were on there. So, the, the main problem is that the drive just doesn't mount. Some systems recognize it, but no one can mount it. And if I can't mount it, I can't recover it. So, basically, I give up and send the drive back to the manufacturer and then get a new one because I still have warranty. And I mean it's not even that much that I lose. I lose a few screenshots that I didn't move to the backup folder. Don't ask me why. And maybe a few text files which I, a few notes which I put on the desktop. But the rest it's all in my Dropbox, so it's all safe. And I also lost the thing that I was working on at the course, so in Bucharest or at the airport because I, I never synced it because I never had um, internet access. Although the thing that I did for CV, I got that back, I talked to my tutor because I made the assignment in Bucharest um, and I told my tutor that he sends it back to me and so I have the result I have my own assignment back yeah so it's not a lot but also the stuff that I put on the SSD two days before it failed uh, which was all the stuff from my mobile phone or all the photos and videos from my mobile phone and so I'm missing vlogs from a week and also all the other photos and videos. Um, but you are missing vlogs. So I, I can tell you what you miss. Um, the first day I was vlogging at the airport because I had my computer that I needed to waste three hours. So put my computer there. I was sitting there and coding for computer vision and it went really well like I all I finished the task I finished what I failed to do all the days before I uh, I was done in those three hours and that really made me happy then I filmed again in Bucharest and told you about it and the day after that I made a vlog in the botanical gardens because we went there because we had nothing better to do because it was just the arrival day because I came one day early um, so we didn't have anything planned we went to the botanical gardens and I filmed there it was also kind of nice um, the first official day of the summer course we went to the biggest park in Bucharest and I was vlogging there there I told you all the things that I miss in Austria like for instance the Uzi Fest and the Augarten Fest and I told you how I like it here that it's not that bad people are taking care of us it's actually kind of nice the streets are a bit um, how did I say it? Not as nice as the streets in Austria. Uh, yeah. That was that. Then we went to a museum there. Uh, and I filmed a lot. But that was not a vlog. Um, what else? The day F after that was the day where we had the international evening. Oh yeah. 
I was vlogging before I went or on my way to the international evening uh, I was carrying a bottle of schnapps I told you that it's the only thing that I have prepared for the international evening uh, but then it turned out that another guy came there and he had a bottle of Stroh 80 which is Austrian thing so I told him come on join me on my table <laughs> and he also performed the show and then I sang I am from Austria it was pretty nice so I didn't expect it to turn out that well also I had my camera with me um, and I was telling you that I have the camera with me because I don't want the camera uh, I don't want to have brought the camera for nothing to Bucharest um, because I'm not bringing it on the city rally and other trips because other guys have their cameras with them and I don't want to carry mine I don't really like to take pictures I like to vlog <laughs> um, yeah that was that day and the day after that Oh man, I made a really cool vlog on that one because it was the day of the city rally by night and I told you that we don't get a lot of sleep and we didn't get a lot of sleep less than six hours about four hours on average I think um, and on that day I used one and a half hours of my free time most of the days we didn't even have that much free time uh, to sleep so I was pretty awake and we had cars we actually had cars that took us from place to place and in that car CMS who was our driver uh, played really good music for instance, the song that I heard before we got out of the car was Oliver Twist and then I made the vlog outside and uh, I had the song in my head Oliver, Oliver, Oliver Twist and I was dancing <laughs> so that was really nice so I really had a smile on my face and behind me was the House of Press and some modern, modern art and then the guys from the course, uh, one guy asked me, are you okay? And I just said, yeah, I'm fine. I wouldn't be okay if I wouldn't do this. Yeah. I'm really sad that I lost this vlog. But whatever. You lose stuff if you don't make backups. So make a backup. So I don't lose the stuff. And you can hear from me tomorrow. That was a bad ending. But who cares? Make it back up. Bye bye.